Safeguarding is about keeping children and adults safe from harm. We all have a responsibility to look out for people's welfare. By keeping our eyes open to what's happening around us, we can make a difference. Be alert, be aware, and act quickly if your instinct tells you something isn't right. Do you think a child is being left on their own? Does somebody appear distressed? Are they trying to tell you something? Has a vulnerable adult recently changed their routine? These are indicators that somebody may need help. Some signs are obvious, but others are hidden. Have you noticed any cuts, bruises, or burns? These could be signs of physical abuse. Have you noticed an increase of people entering and leaving a property? Perhaps you've noticed signs of drug use. This could mean somebody's property has been taken over by criminal activity, referred to as cuckooing. Have you noticed any inappropriate sexual conduct or conversation? This could be a sign of sexual abuse. Has someone changed their spending habits? They could be at risk from financial abuse. Is someone hungry, unkempt and cold? This could be neglect. You have a duty to report any concerns. So what should you do next? If the situation is an emergency, you should dial 999 immediately. For all other safeguarding concerns, contact social services. For adult concerns, call the Adult Safeguarding Team on 29 For child concerns, call the Multi-Agency Safeguarding Hub on 29 For all concerns that are out of office hours, including weekends, call the Emergency Duty Team on 29 our teams are there to support and prompt you to provide as much detail as possible. Don't assume somebody else has reported it. It's always better to pick up the phone and let us know. After reporting your concerns, let your line manager know the date, time and facts. They will then notify the designated safeguarding lead officer, DSLO, for your service area. This information is confidential, so do not discuss it with anybody else. Remember, Safeguarding is everyone's responsibility. You could be protecting someone from harm. View the Wales Safeguarding procedures at safeguarding.wales or download the app today.